Finally, it turned its guide to achieving a low-pitch fibre cement roof that can be used on roof pitches as low as 15 degrees. Make sure you have the correct levels of ventilation. BS5250 states that where a close-fitting roof covering, such as fibre cement slates, is used, then there needs to be sufficient ventilation. The most effective way of doing this is with an eaves vent system and a ventilated dry ridge system. Use a rafter length of up to 4 metres when installing through-tone fibre cement slates at the reduced pitch of 15 degrees. This is because the weather tightness of tiles and slates decreases as the roof pitch gets lower and the rafter length increases because it takes longer for water to drain from the roof. Calculate the gauge for roof battens based on a slate head lap of 110 mm. Gauge equals length of slate minus lap required divided by 2. The 110 mm head lap must be used as it helps to provide more water tightness for the low pitch roof. Set out the roof battens. Allow for the eaves courses of slates to overhang the fascia or tilting fillet so the tails align with the centre of the gutter, approximately 50 mm. Fix the fibre cement slates to the battens using the nail and rivet method in accordance with BS5534 and BS8000-6. Slates should be laid broken bond using slate and a half width slates in alternate course formed from double width slates at verges, hips, valleys and abutments. Allow a 5mm gap between adjacent slates for disc rivet shank. Nail slates firmly, but do not drive nails too tight to the surface of the slate. As this is a low pitch roof, at hips you will need to use double slates beneath the hip capping. At valleys and hips where slates need to be cut on the rake, also use double slates to maintain an adequate width and side lap at the head or tail. There are some specific design considerations when fitting a fibre cement roof with a 15 degree pitch and 4 metre rafters. First of all, the discharge of rainwater from gutters and downpipes from one roof to a low pitch fibre cement roof is not recommended. Skylight roof windows and other penetrations should also not be constructed within the roof. If you do decide to use a vapour permeable underlay, then, despite popular myths, you still need high level ventilation to prevent condensation forming. This would need to be done either through a ventilated dry ridge system, ridge vents or multiple tile vents in accordance with BS5250. In addition to through-tone, Marley Eternit also offers a premium low-pitch fibre cement slate, Birkdale, which can also achieve a roof pitch as low as 15 degrees using hook fixings. For further information, download the latest edition of Marley Eternit's fibre cement fixing guide For further information on our range of products and services, 
just ask me at marleyeternit.co.uk or call me on 01283 722 588.